Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the California Science and Engineering Fair. We offer our gratitude and congratulations to all of our dedicated participants and judges throughout the state of California. This year, we're grateful to have an amazing judging team of professional scientists, engineers, and sponsor organizations from throughout the state and all across the nation who graciously dedicated their time and efforts to make this fair possible. We are proud to exhibit the work of almost 1,000 of California's most bright, talented, and dedicated students, all of whom have set themselves apart and been selected above thousands of their fellow students, just to be admitted into the California Science and Engineering Fair. In addition to these category awards, many of the projects in these categories were also under consideration for a number of sponsored awards. Whether or not you receive a category award be sure to check out the sponsored awards, ICEF and Project of the Year award videos. This video contains awards for the following categories. Earth and Environmental Sciences, Environmental Engineering, Earth and Environment, Air, Water, and Earth and Environment, Soil, Pollution. Panels, S09, J11, S11, J24, and J25. In the field of Earth and Environmental Sciences for the Senior Division, Category S-09 this year's Category Award recipients are An honorable mention to Vivian He, S0920, Cube Network, a low-cost, high-sensitivity consumer seismic network for earthquake early warning, Hollis Verdes Peninsula High School. Receiving an honorable mention, Huck Agar Johnson and Alex Comras. S09-25. An escape from global warming, warming. Brentwood School. Our fourth place winner is Durakau. S0927. Who occupies the changing environment impacts of traits and interspecies co-occurrence on non-native plants spread under climate change in California. Paulus Verdes Peninsula High School. In third place, Marta Pambuchian. S09-21 Leachate filtering efficacy of varied landfill liner powders, year 2 Crescenta Valley High School In second place we have Brian Chen S0911 First identification of cratonic upper mantle earthquakes in Canada The Harker School, Upper Campus And first place goes to Neil Redker S09-18 Carbon N, a novel active transfer learning neural network to build de novo metal organic frameworks, MOFs, for carbon capture. Doherty Valley High School. In the field of environmental engineering for the junior division, category J-11 this year's category award recipients are an honorable mention for Tanvi Thalapale, J1105, Soaking Up Oil Spills on Seawater, St. John's Lutheran School, Bakersfield, CA. An honorable mention to Nandana Maheskumar, Lasya Pandravada, and Sarah Yoshida. J11 11, EEVF, Energy Efficient Vertical Farming, Cabrillo Middle School. Honorable mention goes to Isabel Anani, Anushri Gupta, and Yashvi Shah. J1112, Plant Patrol, Brio Middle School. An honorable mention to Jonathan Zeto. J11 26, a cost effective method using ash to improve the efficacy of oil spill bioremediation with Bacillus subtilis. The Harker School, Middle School. Our fourth place winner is Orkata Chakraborty, J1116, protecting coral reefs from oil spills using a bio-inspired underwater rock with Kytosan and Unified Google Earth Model, Stratford Sunnyvale Rainer Middle School. In third place, Ria Policonda, J1132, extracting microplastic, the effect of three different types of ferrofluids on the removal of microspheres from water. Challenger School, Ardenwood. In second place we have Ronald Wyatt, J1128. How long does it take for superworms to eat styrofoam? Chula Vista Middle School. An 
And first place goes to Ava Bomek. J11-04, a novel low-cost portable apparatus to assess face mask and instrument cover efficacy. The Harker School Middle School. In the field of environmental engineering for the senior division, category S-11 this year's category award recipients are an honorable mention to Jathan Dow, S1114, convenient meter reader, adaptable and affordable home smart meter using IoT, Branham High School. Receiving an honorable mention, Bhuvi Kadia and Ishwar Namani. S1133, a water filtration system for removal of arsenic, nitrate, and bacteria in contaminated groundwater by granular activated carbon treatment and nanofiltration. American High School. An honorable mention to Suhana Srivastava, S1134. Investigating the acoustic similarities of auditory elephant deterrents to optimize currently used techniques. Mission San Jose High School. Our fourth place winner is Arian Jane, S1126. Quantifying greenhouse gas emissions using machine learning via satellite imagery. Amador Valley High School. In third place, Ian Aguilar who won S1109 Robotrash, a cost-effective, AI-powered, fully integrated robot that automatically sorts trash. Palo Alto High School. In second place, we have Yash Narayan. S1132 Deep Waste, applying deep learning on a mobile device for accurate, low-cost, and ubiquitous waste classification. The New Ava School. And first place goes to Jacqueline Proyura. S1101 Cloud development of fish scale waste derived materials for adsorbance of aquatic pollutants Mountain House High School In the field of earth and environment air slash water for the junior division category J-24 this year's category award recipients are Honorable mention goes to Sean Lind and Ethan Van. J2401. Halt the Salt. Santiago Hills Elementary. An honorable mention to Arav Rendawa and Avijit Rendawa. J24 04. Making Mars's atmosphere sustainable for humans with algae. Gerritsen Elementary School. Receiving an honorable mention, Atarv Panachana, J2405. How can we better detect a tsunami? Fairmont Private School, North Tustin Campus. Receiving an honorable mention, Kaylee Sue, J24-13. Using machine learning algorithms to predict water potability. The Bishop School. Receiving an honorable mention, Rhea Devani, J2418. How fertilizer and detergent affect eutrophication in a modeled ecosystem. Marlboro. Our fourth place winner is Zoe Hickman. J24-02. Fresh from the sea. Don B. Chenoweth. In third place, Genevieve Caruso, J2410. Benthic macroinvertebrates in Jacoby Creek, Jacoby Creek School. In second place, we have Jaden Liu, J24-06. Studying the multiple variables and their effects on a home-built aquaponics system. Harker Middle School. And first place goes to Lily Wallace, J2407. An evaluation of microplastic concentration in harbor waters of Santa Barbara as a function of tidal level. La Colina. In the field of earth and environment, soil slash pollution for the junior division, category J-25 this year's category award recipients are. Honorable mention goes to Daisy Luke and Guthrie Luke, J2512. Prevalence of synthetic materials in juvenile environments, polymeric microfiber shedding and air quality. Portola Middle School, highly gifted magnet. 
An honorable mention to Jocelyn Kuhn. J25-16. Z is for Zinnia, making the most of composting. Stratford School, Fremont. Receiving an honorable mention, Marius A. Dirksen and Ruby Dirksen. J2520. Can the eating habits of goats help create a clean energy source to help reduce fire load? International School of Monterey. Our fourth place winner is Savannah Henry. J25-19. Healing burn scars with seeds. Gateway School. In third place, Veronica Howard, J2502, Pesticide Residue on Organic versus Conventional Produce and the Effect of Simple Washing Techniques. Stanford Online High School. In second place, we have JC Salonga, J25-18. What effect do plants have on noise pollution? Rudacinda Sepulveda Dodson, Gifted Magnet Middle School. And first place goes to Isabel Merriman, J2505, Microplastics in Food, A Salty Surprise, Street Brendan Parish School. Congratulations to all our Category Award recipients and everyone who participated in the fair. Remember to check out the other Fairwind Award videos. We are grateful to all of our participants, judges, sponsors, parents, teachers, directors, volunteers, the California Science Center, and everyone who worked so hard to participate in and support this year's California Science and Engineering Fair. <laughs>